Hey guys, welcome back to Never Ending Quest. If you're new here, definitely hit that thumbs up button, hit that subscribe button, and definitely turn on those post notifications. That way you can stay up to date with all these Never Ending Quest vlogs. Today is gonna be special. I'm gonna do my first story time. This one is about the time I met the wrestler Al Snow. So many, many years ago, I helped my girlfriend at the time move to New York City. While we were there, we were hanging out in Times Square, kind of doing the sightseeing, the touristy thing, and we had stopped into a makeup store. Now, I'm with my girlfriend, her sister, her sister's boyfriend, and their mother. So it's the five of us, we're hanging out, looking around, and we pop in this makeup store, right? Well, the night before was my girlfriend's sister's birthday. And while we were at the restaurant, we tipped off the waitstaff after the pay, it's her birthday. What do you guys do for birthdays or something funny, whatever. So of course they had something special planned for the birthdays and she had to get up on a chair and sing and hold a little cake or a cupcake or whatever the birthday treat was or whatever. So she was totally embarrassed and kind of was looking for a little payback. So next night we're in this makeup store, we're walking around and I happen to notice there's a professional WWE wrestler in the store. And my girlfriend at the time, her sister's boyfriend was big into weightlifting and bodybuilding. So anyway, Al Snow's in there and my girlfriend's sister goes up to him and says, Hey, this happened, what would you mind? Uh, you know, just kind of going up and intimidating my boyfriend a little bit. So he's like, oh yeah, sure. Uh, he goes up, tries to, you know, intimidate him in his Al Snow character or whatnot. Turns out that my girlfriend's sister's boyfriend was a larger guy than Al Snow actually was. So didn't really work out that way, but we ended up having um, a really cool conversation with Al Snow in a makeup store and took some pictures and whatnot. He was totally cool. I would have not expected him to be as nice of a guy as he was, only knowing him based on his TV wrestling character. I had that guy totally pegged wrong. We were worried that we were bothering him and, you know, he just wanted to be out shopping with his wife, but that was exactly uh, kind of what he said to us. He was like, no, you guys are no bother at all. Please talk to me. I'm like in a makeup store with my wife like I need some entertainment you know he was really cool and it kind of gave me a perspective of you just never really know how people are in real life and real situations especially celebrities when you meet them so there's people that you, you know you might have pegged a certain way and give you a really good uh, impression of them and, and, and something really good that you take away and I, I know there's people out there where you think highly of somebody and they do something wrong and it completely turns you off from them so have you met any celebrities any athletes any famous people were they who you thought they were or were they not who they thought they were something I've come from the experience I have a couple other celebrity run-in stories that I might share as time goes on but let me know if you enjoyed this one like I said I met Al Snow and it was a pretty cool experience and so shout out to that guy Al Snow not sure if he's still around or where he's at now but a uh, really cool guy definitely not what his character portrayed on WWE TV show Share your stories below in the comments and I uh, appreciate you guys for watching this episode of Never Ending Quest. We'll see you on the next one. Peace.